Yeah, Brian, she certainly put a smile on our faces. Lisa Parks, such a selfless woman with a contagious attitude, really, and she welcomes people coming and going from the airport all day long. But when we talked to her in November, she told us that she had never been on a plane. Well, that is about to change. Lisa, you're going on a flight to anywhere in the United States you want to go. One round trip ticket. Yay! I'm going on a trip. I'm going on a trip. Every day she hears stories. The pretty water, the scenery, the drinks, the warmth. Of places she's dreamed of, California, Las Vegas, or Hawaii. Aloha. But one thing always stood in her way. I never had the money. I've never flown. That's one of my goals in life. I want to fly. In our story about unsung heroes during the holiday season. I'm doing my own little thing anyway. Lisa Parks caught the attention of her own company for how she treats her fellow employees. Hey. And her customers. <laughs> we struggle every day to find employees. She achieves a big goal for us here in Charlotte, and that is treating people well every single day with her big, giant heart. How you doing? Oh, I'm amazing. How you doing? So Mary Ruberry, chief people officer at the parking spot, flew in from Chicago to give parks a round trip to anywhere in the United States. So we wanted to get her an airline ticket. We knew that if she had never been on an airplane, she'd need luggage. Here's your luggage, sweetheart. That's mine. That's yours. Yep. Parks, who has never been outside North or South Carolina, is now dreaming of her first vacation, all expenses paid. Just registering it all and where I want to go, woo, mm. where I want to go, like Ric Flair. Mm. And she's touched that for a change, someone thought of her first. Thinking of me, you know, thinking of me sometimes. That's, I ain't, ooh, and I always think of other people, never putting me first. And... They thought about me. That made me want to cry. Can't cry for the camera. Okay. Cut! <laughs> <laughs> oh, she is such a character. Lisa said the first thing she is going to do when she goes on this vacation, she is going to put her feet in the sand. And we kind of have a bet. We think she's going to choose Hawaii. But when she finally chooses her destination, the surprises aren't over. Her company is going to probably work with her to get a hotel room, maybe a little bit of cash to spend on the side, maybe a spa day. Um, they're going to really make it special for her, that's for sure. And of course, wherever she goes, she'll probably get some free parking. Reporting live in West Charlotte, I'm Morgan Francis, Queen City News.